In this video, we will look at how to submit a view for grading to a group. If you are in a group that has been set up as a course group, you can then submit views to that group for grading by a group administrator or tutor. You must have a view already created that you would like to submit. Visit your group page either by clicking on it in the side panel once you are logged into the site or by going to the Groups tab and finding it in the list and clicking on it there. Once you are viewing the group page, you can scroll down and see that underneath the latest forum posts is a section called Views. You will have the option here to choose a view from those in your list and submit it as an assignment. You are given a warning message that states if you submit your view for assessment, you will not be able to edit it until your tutor has finished marking it. If you are sure you wish to proceed, click Yes. Click No to continue making changes to your view before submitting. Once you have submitted your view, you will be taken back to the group page where you will see a message saying that it has been submitted and what time. A tutor can see the submitted views when they visit the group page. Clicking on one will let them view it. At this point, they can place feedback and they can release the view, which means that it can be edited by the student again. A student is emailed when feedback is placed on their view. They are emailed again once the view has been released back to them. Placing feedback does not release the view. This allows several tutors to place feedback on a view before it is released back to the student. We will go into more detail about the marking of views later in the course. Once the view has been marked, the student can log in and revisit it. They can also see in their recent activity that feedback has been placed and the view has been released back to them. If they go and look at their view, they will see the feedback at the bottom. If the feedback hasn't already been made public by the tutor, the student can choose to make the feedback public by clicking on the buttons to the right. 